I think it's hard to imagine what the future will look like, but some challenges are enduring. The challenge of making meaningful policies, of engaging citizens, are even more acute today than they were 30 years ago, and they're likely going to be more acute 30 years from now. I think that not all governments are going to look the same by 2030 or 2050. I think um, that a lot of what will determine the face of government and what government looks like and feels like to citizens is whether governments are able to leverage um, technology. The other uh, aspect that is going to be really critical is whether governments are able to restore trust in public institutions. There has been, as I said, a breakdown of trust uh, between society and government. And, and the job will be for the incoming generations of, of civil servants and government uh, employees to find ways to, to build that trust, to better communicate with citizens, and again, reflect that much more efficiently and effectively in government policy and the provision of services. The issue of, uh, of uh, the government of the future is really a, a much more agile and I think this concept of government as a platform rather than as a, as, as a bureaucracy is quite powerful. Why it's so important for young people to be involved and to be part of this transformation is because they're really the driving force of making governance much more dynamic and agile. I would say to them that if you're interested in tackling some of the most challenging problems that exist in the world today, if you're interested in really making a difference to the lives of people around the world, then joining the public sector is probably a good option for you. I think public service is, is, is critically important because it is a tangible way in, in which you as an individual can contribute uh, to society, contribute to the betterment of, uh, of, of citizens in, in your country and contribute to uh, the, the globe as a whole. It really is that sense that you're there because you want the lives of your fellow citizens to change for the better. So that sense of making a difference. And if I could ex encapsulate it uh, in a quote, it would be Leonard Cohen's quote, which is, there is a crack in everything, and that's how the light gets in. So it's really about finding that crack where light will come through for our fellow citizens. Thank you.